In this video, I'm going to introduce students how to download your practice exercise and then upload it to the TIP 10 online training module so you can begin the practices and complete them. One of the first things I'd actually advise students to do is to make a folder somewhere on your computer to store all of your practice files. In this example, I'm going to go ahead and come out to my desktop and right click and say new folder and I'll name this CIT102. Now, I need to download my practice file for Unit 1, Lesson 1 from the textbook. One thing to point out is the file type that TIP10 recognizes is what is called a .txt file. This is a text file. If I were to just click on this by default, it would actually open up in a brand new browser window. Instead, whenever you're ready to download, you are going to want to right click and navigate down to save link as. From there, navigate on your computer where you made your folder to hold your files. So I'm going to navigate to my desktop where I made the CIT102 folder. Now I can actually compare here. There's the name of my file and down here I can also see the file name and the save as type which is set to text document. You do not want to change either of these, uh, either of these items. You'll just want to go ahead and navigate into the folder and click Save. Now if I check my folder, you can now see that my document has appeared in the folder here. It is now stored on my local computer and it's ready to be uploaded to the TIP10 website. When you're ready to upload your practice file, you're going to want to navigate to TIP10 and navigate under Training. Under the Training, you're going to want to navigate using the left-hand navigation to Own Lessons. Please note that I have more here as I was building all of the unit lessons out. So you might not actually have to scroll when you first come here, but what you're looking for is Add Import Lesson. So if I go ahead and click on this, you're going to see an own lesson area pop up here with a bunch of boxes. We actually don't need to type anything in here at all. You want to locate down at the bottom on the left hand side here this import lesson. And if you click on that, navigate on your computer, in my case on my desktop in my CIT102 folder, and locate that text document you downloaded from Blackboard. You can say open Notice that everything will be filled in for you, including what it will reference in the program. So in this case, you're going to get the virtual keyboard. And then you'll want to hit Save. Now in this video, I'm going to hit Cancel since I have already have a copy. But when you save, you'll then see under the Own Lessons, you will now see the Unit 1 Lesson 1 new key reinforcement appear. And you would be able then to start your practice. That's the process of downloading off a of Blackboard and getting your practice file and then uploading it to TIP10 when you're ready to start doing your exercises.